This tutorial will guide you through utilizing the Material Reference Report. The Material Reference Report is used to provide a list of materials that are needed to create your final item. It is used in conjunction with the Spec Info tab of the item under your projects and specifications. To learn more about the Spec Info tab, see the Help section on Using Specification Sheets and Templates. Information added to the Spec Info tab will appear on the Material Reference Report. For example, here we have the Bradshaw Armchair. This is the final product. The Spec Info tab includes the dimensions and any other important information about the chair. The next item is used to specify the fabric. On the Spec Info tab, we have selected the Material option to show that this fabric is a material needed to create the final product. The next item created is for the selected wood to be used for the frame of the chair. This is also marked as a material needed for the final product. Once you generate all of the items needed to purchase that will make up the final product, you can run the material reference report to show and print these materials. The report is run by project code and has options to enter ranges for location, template number, plan number, manufacturer, and source. You may also select to show only the items that were marked as materials on the Spec Info tab. Selecting No will show all items, which will include the item for the final product on the report. This concludes our tutorial on utilizing the Material Reference Report. To review more tutorials and knowledge base articles, please visit our Help Center at designmanager.com.